just arrived at the Civic Centre for a meeting, a chair's meeting, chairman's meeting, of the Corporate Resources Overview and Scrutiny Committee. What a mouthful. Uh, but this is a meeting that uh, checks through the agenda for the full meeting in a couple of weeks' time. Well, the meeting is now over and it took a lot longer than we expected because uh, we had quite a long discussion about council um, uh, staff absences um, because of health uh, health issues. And uh, the figures are actually quite shocking because uh, uh, basically the average is um, two and a half weeks a year, uh, which is a phenomenal amount of time to take off as an average uh, for sick leave. Uh, so we had a very long discussion uh, about that. Uh, plus there were other issues uh, that we had a discussion about but they will all come up on the agenda that, uh, for the meeting in a couple of weeks time it was just uh, me uh, as the deputy chairman and the chairman of the committee there along with the officers to discuss the agenda uh, he also called into the mayor's office and uh, the bad news is that uh, we can't get either the mayor or the deputy mayor to come along and open the Sunnyside fair on the 14th of July. Uh, so I am looking for somebody who is well known, uh, who is not a politician like me, uh, who will be prepared to open the fair. And at the minute, I can't think of anyone I know who would do that. It's forecast that there's going to be a big storm tonight. It's called Storm Hector and it is heading for northern Britain from the Atlantic and although it seems peaceful now within a few hours we're going to have an awful lot of rain and gales. In fact I'm actually um, feeling the, the rain starting to fall now. Now every evening I go out and pick a whole load of leaves for the goats so that they can get them first thing in the morning and tonight I am doing that but I'm going to get double quantities because the, it looks like if everything is going to be soaking wet tomorrow and it's forecast to stop raining around about lunchtime but if everything is soaking wet then I don't particularly want to be picking fresh leaves uh, whilst getting soaked in the process so I'm going to get them double helpings uh, for tomorrow and uh, try and get it all back in the wheelbarrow so this is what I'm picking it's mainly nettle and willow herb, or a bit of goosegrass and bramble in there as well. And this area here I've cleared over the last couple of days. This is a site right on the edge of the Winnies. It actually belongs to the Winnies, but it is unused. So uh, they're always quite happy for me to come in and clear it. I think this should be enough for tomorrow morning and early afternoon 